Uh, hey, good morning. Uh, my name's Corporal Neil Craig. This morning we're going to be taking you through what we do to dispatch an aircraft while we're operating here in the mountains. Okay, so first thing we're going to do is we are going to take the covers off the aircraft. So this cover up here protects the main rotor hub, especially around here we can occasionally get birds trying to nest in here. Okay, so with the covers off now, we're going to crack into the dispatch, doing a uh, fuel drain. So I'm looking for sand and dirt in the bottom. I'm looking for water droplets in the bottom. I'm also looking for water um, entrained in the, the actual fuel. Let's check in the hoist. I'm um, just making sure there's still oil in the hoist for while they use it today. Uh, it's pretty important because if there is no oil while they're using it, it can jam up, it can overheat, which is not good. Got something on the end of the line. Uh, we check the tower rotor bearing. Rotor's turning! We're just making sure that they haven't flipped. So here I'm just checking the hanger bearings. So we've got slippage marks on the inner and outer race of these bearings. So what we're doing is we're just checking to make sure that these haven't moved from the previous flying. Check the battery level, we check the hydraulic accumulator levels. We just, yeah, just give the aircraft the once over. Ooh, can't feel my fingers. So yeah, before we apply power, we'll do a switch check just to make sure that anything that's turned on when we apply power won't turn on and damage an aircraft. Power coming on. All right, so that's how we do a dispatch while we're operating here out of the mountains. Now she's ready for a full day's flying with the aircrew.